and we listen. We are going to react to the second half, the anthology of the Tortured Poets Department. Disclaimer. We listened to it the night it came out, but I was editing the whole time we were listening to it because I was trying to post all my videos live. And I was playing Fortnite, the game. <laughs> By the way, I'm McCall. And I'm Madison. We're sisters and we're Swifties. Rock on, rock star. Rock star. <laughs> Take this as you will. We basically heard it, but I feel like I haven't, you know? So here we are. Oh, also I got my face painted, but um, <laughs> listening to the Torture Post Department, the anthology. Make sure you stay until the end of the video to hear our conspiracy theories and some exciting information about us going to the Aeros Tour again. Track 17, the black Black dog. Scared emoji. In your location, you forgot to turn it off. So <laughs> That's so real. You Did you see the Black Dog posted about this? No. On TikTok. Tom's posted about the album. Yes. How you don't miss me in the Black Dog when someone plays the starting line and you jump up, but she's too young to know this song that was intertwined in the magic fabric of our dreaming. Old habits die. Sweet. That part I have heard quite a few times. I love that part though. That's so good. Move through the world the way I did for you. You said I needed a brave man and proceeded to play him until I believed it too. Ouch. And it kills me. Don't worry, she can do it with a broken heart. <laughs> How you don't miss me in the shower and remember Rain-soaked body was shaking Old habits die Scream Gorgeous Six weeks of breathing clean air I still miss the smoke Were you making fun of me With some esoteric joke Now I want to tell my house Esoteric joke I love the vocal production on that one. I'm looking forward to my next breakup because of this album. <laughs> Y'all were up in the comment section laughing at us because we missed some iconic lyrics. This time, we're playing the lyric videos. We're gonna try to catch all the things. Up next, I'm gonna get you back. She looks so pretty in that picture. Oh. Wait, 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 wait. In her Fortnite challenge video, she's playing pickable. Pick a ball. In the pick a ball. Stop. In the Fortnite challenge YouTube video, she's wearing a lilac skirt. She may have multiple. Did your research? You knew the price going in. A billion dollars. <laughs> I can tell when somebody still wants me. Come clean, standing at the bar like something's funny. Yeah, yeah. Probably once you fix your face, I'm going in. Once you fix your face, oh, she's going in. Yeah. Look at my Whether I'm gonna be your wife or gonna smash up your bike, I haven't decided yet. But I'm gonna get you. She's back. so real for that. Completely different vibe, they don't sound the same, but it's like getting back by Olivia Rodrigo. But more, oh. like, but more whimsical. Yes. Act like I don't care what you did. She don't care. I'm an Aston Martin. What's that? I don't know. She stood straight into the ditch. Oh, maybe a car? Smash up your bike, I haven't decided yet, but I'm gonna get you Pick your poison, I'm poison either way. That was my mic drop. I'm gonna get you back. Woo! I liked it. I liked it too, it was saucy. I was surprised that there wasn't a song called Eras, and it was like, this is the end of our era, or like this era of us is over. 
Well, I just don't feel like this is the album. Besides like in the way she does, I can do it with a broken heart where it makes sense to bring up tour. Well, no, it wouldn't be bringing up tour, just be using the word era. This is the end of our era. This era of us is over. Just saying. <laughs> the next one is the Albatross and I really, really like this one. <gasps> Ooh. Wise men yeah. once said, wild winds are death to the candle as <laughs> they try to warn him about her. Ooh, this is a cool perspective. She is here to destroy you, but I'd visit in your dreams and they tried to warn you about me. Cross your thoughtless heart, only thicker annoys you. She's the Albatross? A snake? A bird? Oh. <laughs> I swear there's a snake called Albatross. absolutely love the storyline happening in that song. Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, it's Taylor Swift. <laughs> the next song is Chloe or Sam or Sophia or Marcus. Ooh, okay, photo. You hologram stumbled into my apartment Hands in the hair of somebody in darkness Named Chloe or Sam or Sophia or Marcus And I just watched it happen as the decade would play us for fools And you saw my bones out with somebody new Who seemed like he would have bullied you in school And you just watch it happen You cheated on me and now I'm dating someone that looks like he could bully you My cold, cold heart Just say I loved you The way that you were I love that line you said some things that I can't unabsorb You turned me into an idea of sorts You needed me, but you needed drugs more And I couldn't watch it happen I changed into goddesses, villains and fools Changed plans and lovers This is giving like folklore evermore All to outrun my desertion of you And you just watched it I really like that one because I relate to the idea like of somebody going away and you thinking I'm better off without them. But if they were to come back and say, I loved you the way that you were, that would be cause for pause. I would be like, oof, that was so folklore in the most beautiful way. Sonically, it has a little bit of everything, but the lyrics feel very charged in like a Midnight's Reputation way. Up next is How Did It End? I think this is the one that has all the lyrics that were in the big fat book. Oh. A lot of them. Oh. I need to hear this on the piano live. And this has the post morning one. She deals with that on a larger scale than anybody else. People being like, well, what happened? We learned the right steps to different dances. 
dancing with the hand stuff. I got chills. I've experienced that on a very small scale. Well, what happened? Well, it's not your business. Any scale feels really big at the time. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because everybody cares about what you're going through once it's drama. And they don't care because they care about you, they just want to know. I don't know what bereft means. She keeps calling back to her youth and the D I or K I S S I N G. So the way she said that, very um. Oh, in a dream. Yeah. Oh. Oh, she doesn't even know. Holy cow, that was so good. I'm really liking the second part of this album. Mm -hmm. Up next, we have So High School, and I listened to this in the car today. We're more familiar with this track. Let's take another listen. I love this. It feels like nostalgic for some reason. Like high school, would you say? <laughs> like Alpha Levine, I don't know. <laughs> Pause. I'm so sorry. Yeah, you're right. I saw something on Twitter. It's very slight. At some point in the song, I think it's towards the end. Oh, you're gonna love it. I'm this. listening. Go, go. The letters T S and T K are in a baby pink instead of white. Are you for serious? I'm for serious. Yeah. T K. That is extremely subtle. Is it? Y'all, my sister was right. Look what happens when I turn up the saturation. The T K and the T S are pink. Tell me again what you thought when you met me. I know, that's, that is so real. Yeah. The merry kiss or kill me, if you know, you know. What? I didn't know that was a lyric. Love that line. song has me like giggling and kicking my feet. You know Mans was kicking his feet when he heard that song. I just caught at the end she does like a she goes, feel so high school. In the back, she goes, so high school. I heard that too. I love the idea that you can be in your 30s and a love can feel like you're in high school again. Youth is wasted on the young, they say. What? Okay. You never heard that? I think I've heard it, but I just didn't expect you to whip it out like that. Oh. <laughs> Next song is I Hate It Here. Me too, girl. Can't relate. Quick, quick, tell me so. What was that? I thought she said quick, quack. <laughs> quick, quick, tell me something awful. Like you are a poet, trapped inside the body of a finance star. Tell me all. Did someone say that, you All think? I don't know. You see, I was a debutant in another life, but now I seem to be scared to go outside. If comfort is a construct, I don't believe in good luck. Now that I know what's what, I hate it here, so I will go to secret gardens in my Oh, I saw this audio on TikTok. So cute. The only one is mine. I was a precocious child, though it's 
city hopes and small town fears. If Taylor and I have one thing in common, it's loving escapism. <laughs> She's in her mind most of the time. I think so. It's a place only she can go. I'm lonely, but I'm good. I'm bitter, but I swear I'm fine. I save all my romanticism for my inner life. This is so real. This place may be worthless. Oh. Lucid dreams like electricity. The current flies through me. I'm in my fantasies. I rise above it. Actually love it. I hate it here, so I will I love this one. Gardens in my mind. I really like it. That one, there was a few. I need to I related to that so hard. Next up, thank you, Amy. And we have heard this one. Yes. This intro sounds like a movie. Coming like of age. Movie. Yeah. I lived This would be good for a coming of age. Like accepting that but something hurt you and my hometown. There's a bronze spray tan statue of you. But I dreamed that one day I could say, All that time you were throwing punches, I was building something. And I can't forget the way you made me feel. Screamed, fuck you, Amy, to the night sky as the blood was gushing. She said what she said. She needed to say it. Thank you, Amy is even capitalized in the lyric video. This line goes crazy. I did not catch that line. Mama Swift is a savage. Oh, and that's cool. <laughs> Thank you, Amy. Is that poetic, did you think? Thank you, Amy. <laughs> Thank you, Amy. I wanted to sign it. I felt confident. <laughs> what did you think about that? I really like that and I really like how it's instead of just focusing on like getting that person back, it was building herself back up and then not forgetting but acknowledging that like without that you wouldn't be where you are today and it helped you heal i think it's a really good take on being bullied or going through something negative someone's trying to tear you down where well, you're building yourself up babe the next song is inspired by joe goldberg if you know you know it's called i look in people's windows did she say it was inspired no i'm saying it okay The tiniest death. I spy the catch in your breath. Out, 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 out. As you boarded your trains out. Choo choo! South, south, south. What's that guy's name? South. Thomas the Choo Choo Train. The fact I look in people's windows. Facts, they do that every day. Rose Golden Glows. They have the Rose Golden Glows is a cool drink. line. Wow. I look in people's windows in case you're at their table. Did it get over here? <laughs> That's so real. We've all done it. I'm kidding. Does it feel alright to not know me? I'm addicted to the if only time. What if we like made eye contact one last time? It was crazy. The song is saying that she looks for him everywhere and she notices him everywhere. It reminds me of Sabrina Carpenter's song that's like, I used a fork, or like, you used a oh. fork once. Now forks are fucking everywhere. Yeah. This is another one that really piqued my interest, so I'm very familiar with the prophecy. Hand on the throttle, thought I caught lightning in a bottle. Oh, but it's gone again. And it was written, I got cursed like Eve got bitten. Ooh. Oh, was it punishment? Okay. Pat around when I get home, 
I guess a lesser woman would have lost hope A greater woman wouldn't beg But I looked to the sky and said Please, I've been on my knees Change the prophecy Don't want money, just someone who wants my company Let it once be me Who do I have to speak to About if they can redo the prophecy That's cool. Cards on the table I like the pace of the song mm -hmm. A greater woman stays cool But I howl like a wolf at the moon Ooh. Ow. And I look unstable okay. I've sealed my fate No sign of soulmates I'm just a paper This song is so relatable. I want a boyfriend so bad. The ooze remind me of Dorothea. Ooh. Whoa. Ooh. I love this woman's voice. I love that she's like a lesser woman would have just given up and a greater woman, whatever, however she phrased it, wouldn't beg. But she's this weird place in the middle. This next one is called Cassandra. It's our mom's favorite and swear I've never heard it. Mom was talking to me about it and I was like, what? I did not hear that one. Do you want what it's about before? See if you can get it after. I wanna try to get it. Okay. I was in my new house placing daydreams Ooh. Patching up the crack along the wall Cause that's where I was when I got the call Ooh. In the streets there's a raging riot When it's burned the bitch they're shrieking Cause she feared the worst So they filled my cell with snakes I regret to say Do you believe me now? I think I know what it's about <laughs> uh, They say what doesn't kill you Makes you aware Ooh. What happens if it becomes Who you are Ooh. So they set my life in flames I regret to say Tell me she hasn't re-recorded Reputation after that. Wow, oh, it's so beautiful. They all said nothing. Blood's thick, but nothing like a payroll. That they never spared a prayer for my soul. Oh, that'll do it for me. Is it giving mad woman? It is. It's so quiet. Wow, the whispering. That song is so beautiful and it's also so relatable. Anytime someone lies about you, if the truth comes out, nobody cares. Everyone just goes, oh, okay, never mind. It's like, <laughs> I'm wondering where she got Cassandra and I'm wondering if the track that Aaron Dessner brought to the table, he had nicknamed Cassandra. If it started just t t a bit. T t t I was just wondering if it's t t t that's interesting because it took you five takes to say two different things tonight. You really thought you ate? Up next, Peter. Pan. Yeah. Peter Pan. It's not Forgive me, Peter. My lost fearless leader. In closets like cedar. Preserved from when we were just kids. Hey, Nori. 
boring. Should I bring up Peter losing Wendy? Ah. Uh, I saw that on Twitter. That was not an original idea. Are you still a mind reader? A natural scene stealer? I've heard great things, Peter. But life was always easier on you. Than it was on me. And I didn't want to hang around. We said it was just goodbye for now. I can't do that. Can't do that you though. said you were gonna go. This one's a sucker punch because I feel like everybody has relationships where they're like, we're growing apart right now, but we'll fix it. I won't confess that I waited. Oh! It's so weird that this track is silent. <laughs> you can't hear anything. I do listen to that and I see Peter Pan and Wendy and like they go on that adventure, they come back. He's like, I'll come back. Like I will grow up for you and we can be together. And when he does return like briefly, she's all grown up. What stood out to me in that song was about the promises and when people promise to be better or to be different. Yeah. And they don't follow through on that. And so it's like they make this huge promise about all the things they're gonna do for you and they stay the same. You can even fall in love with who someone says they're gonna be for you. Mm -hmm. Up next, the vulture. I really like this one. Well, cause you know what I think it's giving? Getaway car, not even sonically, concept wise. Sorry, I have to go. Funky bait. By all accounts, she almost drowned when she was six in frigid water. With a quiet bewitching face, splendidly selfish, charmingly helpless, excellent fun till you get to know her. Then she runs like it's a race. Oh. Behind her back, her best mates laughed. And they nicknamed her the Bolter. Started with a kiss, oh, we must start beating like this. Oh. But it always ends up with a town car speeding. Out the drive one evening. And then with the slam of a door, then he'll call her a whore. I wish he wouldn't be sore, but if she was leaving, it felt like breathing. Very getaway car, no? These trucks are so relatable. <laughs> a cat wanted her bad just like any good trophy hunter a charming saturday that's when she sees the littlest leaks down in the floorboards and she just knows she must bolt started with a kiss oh we must stop beating like this but it always ends up with a town car speeding men of many faces first they're off to the races and she's laughing I love because it feels like Getaway Car got a rebrand. These songs are so good. Up next is Robin, and Robin is a nickname for Aaron Dessner's kid, apparently. This one I've had a hard time understanding. Okay. Yeah. I'm really gonna zone in and read here. Dessner's kid sounds crazy. It's not about the kid. <laughs> Strings tied to levers slowed down. This sounds like a song. Tethered to swear scouts on her. You know what she wanted and boy, you got it. 
I googled it and apparently it's about a person that's in charge but is super emotionally immature. It's like way to go tiger. Oh. Now we're having beef with frosted flakes. If someone wrote that about me, I'd have to Even rethink my life. We all vow to keep it from you. Mm. But he's bad, I think. You got the dragonflies above you, but first of all, I find that song to be very beautiful. Second of all, for whatever reason, I'm having the hardest time getting a grasp on it. Are you not understanding? Why? Well, I don't know. It just feels a little, like for me personally, it's just out of my grasp. It's a very specific situation to relate to, but I can't think of a way I relate to it currently. Up next, the manuscript. People are saying the manuscript is like Taylor's evolved view of All Too Well after shooting the short film. Really? Well, the last line is the story's not mine anymore, which is notorious for All Too Well. You've changed the song for me type of beat. <laughs> This is the last one, right? I don't think. Oh yeah, <gasps> this is the last one. Wait, I'm sad. Okay, wait. Soak it in, soak it in. I'm soaking. Okay. Now and then she rereads the manuscript. This is so cool. Mm -hmm. Of the entire torrid affair. The script for the short film. Yeah. They compared their licenses. He said, I'm not a donor, but I give you my heart if you need it. That is such a clever she line. She her eyes and said, you're a professional. He said, no, just a good Samaritan. He said that if the sex is half as good as the conversation was, soon they'd be pushing strollers. She's really letting us process that line. <laughs> In the age of him, she wished she was 30. And made coffee every morning in a French press. Afterwards, she only ate kids cereal. Oh. And couldn't sleep unless it was in a mother's bed. Oh. And the years passed like scenes of a show. The professor said to write what you know. Ending the whole album, the story is not mine anymore, as another reminder that it's ours to interpret for ourselves. But I get the connection to All Too Well, to go through something, not process it, have an opportunity to do so with the short film, with a manuscript, and then be able to say, okay, I wipe my hands of this. I freaking love that song. <laughs> that was the best lyric video I have ever watched. I know, so if you haven't watched the lyric video for the manuscript, it's Tons of takes for everything, and you just spit. Friend. And you just spit. <laughs> Whoa! Be careful, you're in the splash zone. You're in the splash zone. You're making me hate everything. It's time for conspiracy theories. It is that serious. Do you think Miss Teller is gonna add a section for the tortured poets department on the Eras tour? No. I don't see that being feasible. This sounds super dramatic. I almost don't think it would be healthy. I'm gonna go crazy. And I'm gonna say she's going to add it. Okay. I think us disagreeing will be fun for when we go. I think she's going to take out songs 
from other sets. And I have an idea of what she would take out from each set. I think she would take out delicate. Style. Ooh. Okay, back up because I think she would take out the archer because she already did yeah. for the movie. Cardigan, ones that were already cut out of the movie. The red set, I feel like, could be skimmy down. Let me know what you think in the comment section. All I can say is make sure you subscribe because we are going to the Ares tour very soon. Thank you for watching. We'll see you and Taylor very soon. Bye!